Superintendent of Public Instruction is calling cell phone addiction among students a statewide emergency. It's such a big topic for him that he held a news conference today to push for a cell phone ban. We're talking statewide at all Arizona schools. This is the second time he's tried to do so. A similar bill passed the legislature during the last legislative session, but it was vetoed by Governor Katie Hobbs. Our news for two stars, Jafet Serrato, is live in Phoenix. And Jafet, why does the superintendent think this bill is going to pass the second time around? Monica, he says he wants every Arizonan this time around to watch this story and to call Governor Katie Hobbs' office to tell her not to veto this bill. One of the speakers at this news conference includes a Payson School District governing board member who says she's in favor of passing a bill like this for all of Arizona schools. Cell phones in classrooms are also a tremendous distraction. We had a teacher up in Payson who decided to do a little experiment of her own. When she came into class, she cleared her whiteboard and she asked the students at the beginning of class, each time that you are distracted or are thinking about your cell phone, I'd like you to come up to the front of the classroom, make a tally on the board. Amazingly, by the end of class, the entire board was covered with tallies. Arizona Superintendent of Public Instruction Tom Horn was at this news conference, along with seat Senator Shauna Bullock and former TUSD teacher Mitchell Rutherford. You may remember we talked to Rutherford in May when he quit his job because student cell phone addiction was just too much for him. This bill endorsed by Horn would prohibit students from carrying their phones during the entire school day. Speakers at the conference say teachers should not have to constantly remind students to turn off their devices. It's a topic that seat lawmakers are looking at closely, going as far to say that it impacts students' mental health. My son's school, they had to put their cell phones from grades 5 through 12 in their locker during the day, and there were some fewer issues at that school. So obviously I'm a parent. Uh, my kids are grown now, um, but I would like to actually make sure that we're wa watching out for um, students who are in the classroom and also reducing cyberbullying. Superintendent Horn says this issue should not be a political debate. He adds that if we just allow school districts to do their own uh, rules, that this issue is never going to get resolved. Live in Phoenix, Fetzerado, News 4 Tucson.